Hello, I got the Udo Cohen. It's my new passion is creating what I call Om Gong because of all the various sounds. I'm going to do a quick demonstration of how to play this one. You play it like any hand percussion instrument, alternating from one hand to the other. I suggest leading with your dominant hand if you're right or you're left handed. That's the key. There's different parts of the Cohen that you can play to get good different sounds. Play towards the bottom. You get a bass here, tone, and then when you play towards the top with the fingers, you get what we call the open tone. So towards the bottom, middle. So you hear the difference between the bass and the open tones. Depending on what side you play, on the one side, the side I was just playing, has a traditional snare uh, sound. And then when you switch it to this side, you get, you play the cajon without the snare sound. So you get a, a, a different, different tonality. So listen to this. that to this where you can hear the snares so it gives you some choices with uh, the various timber sounds you can get from playing this one hand percussion instrument there's different ways that you can play the cajon uh, using your fingers together and like this up, as you know, it's when you play up here, no thumbs, okay? But you can use the thumb with the dominant hand to create a thumpy bass tone. And another cool sound you can explore is using your knuckles to play uh, a sharp type bass tone. Either one hand, you can do a mixture, you can do stuff like this. Now, so now, bending and changing the pitch. So, what you can do, I like using my non dominant hand to add pressure on and off from the top. You'll see how it changes the pitch. Listen to this. You can combine that with some different rhythms. So let me see what. Here's the other side that doesn't have the snare sound, just so you can compare both sides. Here's another creation of mine. It's own cajon. See this this different size, it's hexagon shape. And you can play it the same way. The sounds are a little bit different on this, and but you can play bass tones, open tones, uh, the thumpy bass tone, and what's the other one? The sharp 
bass tones. So you could play them all the same way on this drum. So same idea, one side you get the kind of the snare sound, the other side is a drier tone. So listen to this. Now listen to this side. 